Hello, I'm Sequoia Simone and I'm a nerd writer. In the fall of 2009, I had just started college, I was a freshman in college. It was great because my dad lived two blocks away from my university. So we didn't have to spend the money for me to live on campus, which is great because that is extra expensive. But the flip side of that was that all my friends that I went to high school with who also went to this same college, they lived up in the residence halls and I did not. So I sort of found myself in a place where I wasn't connecting to the people I was going to school with. I couldn't connect with my old high school friends. So I went back to something that has always been very, very important to me, and that's Harry Potter. Someone had sent me a link to a Harry Potter musical. So I finally got around to watching it and I thought, wow, this is the greatest thing ever. So I started going back through their old videos. I found a performance that they had done at a Harry Potter convention and I was transformed. I went out and got a job. Like I didn't have a job. And I was like, yes, I have to go to this thing so bad that I'm gonna go get a job so I can afford to go to Florida. So once I had gotten my registration and gotten my job and I was like ready and I knew I was gonna go, I realized I needed roommates and I realized that I had no friends that were going. So I went onto the message boards for the convention and there was one specifically for finding roommates. So I went on there and I was sort of looking around trying to find people that I thought would be compatible with me and people kept writing DFTBA or Nerdfighter at the end of their posts, which was very intriguing to me. I think it was October or September of 2009 when I found the channel and there was 500 something videos by then and I went back and I watched every single one of them. I felt very inspired by these people. I was in a weird transitionary point in my life and there wasn't many people that I could talk to about it and there wasn't a lot of people who I thought would understand and I was really afraid to put myself out there. I was 18 years old and I was still writing Harry Potter fan fiction and I like I didn't know if that was gonna be acceptable to anyone. I started spending a lot of time on the Nerdfighter forums and because I was in such a transitionary place and I wasn't feeling like I had a lot of friends I found a collab channel to join. Having that as my introduction into the world of Nerdfighteria was amazing. At that point in my life, Nerdfighteria meant friends to me. It meant being myself, being enthusiastic. In a way that hasn't really changed, but in a another way it has changed. As I've gotten older, Nerdfighteria has become so much more inspiring to me. I see Nerdfighters and I see John and Hank doing all of these wonderful things that are like contributing to society in a way that no one else can and no one else does and it inspires me to, to be that and to follow my dreams and to do all of these like crazy things that I never thought I could do. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore, now I'm just sort of rambling, but the main point is that I found Nerdfighteria the same way many, many people did, which was the Harry Potter fandom, um, and both of those things are so important to me still, and I'm still learning things from them, and I'm still growing because of the Harry Potter fandom and because of Nerdfighteria, and I wouldn't exchange that for anything.